Hello everybody, welcome back to Birdie Boots. Do excuse the orange makeup, I just got finished doing what I think is my dream sponsorship. It should be off my Instagram, my Twitter within the next week or so. If you do see it, please give it a like because if I get to do more sponsorships like this, I will be so, so happy. It's for something that a lot of people know I love. So that's why I look like a hot Cheeto today. It's not for Cheetos. <laughs> I just, it needed orange. That's all you need to know. Oh boy have I got the video for you today because this is like nothing I've ever seen in my life. So if you guys remember in the last episode of Birdie Boots, um, we were looking at the newbie family that Maxis slash EA created. Um, and a lot of you guys are saying that actually it was like an amalgamation of the newbies from The Sims 1 and The Sims 2 and The Sims 2 console and stuff, yada, 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 yada. Um, point being, I had to go onto the gallery in order to download the family, right? And that's how I found out it was created by Maxis. And just after I finished filming that video, I needed to grab a little screenshot for it. So I clicked on Maxis to see everything that they've created. And there's some really cool stuff in here. Let me just show you. So if you if you search up the um, ID uh, Maxis on the gallery and you look at the homes, they've got some really cute stuff like Oasis Tiny Home. Look, that's adorable, right? That's really cute. All these ones that they've made that look really, really nice. But then, as you calm down, just scroll a little bit, and then this. It stood out to me right away. Um, it was actually one of the first ones that came up the other day, but look at it. What the fuck is that? So I haven't downloaded this, it's not in my game. Um, I thought we could do it together. I think we should have a little deep dive and see just what the hell is going on with the ultimate bachelor pad. First off, let's just let's just take a moment just to celebrate the build quality of, of the Max's team. Bravo, guys. You have you have excelled yourselves. So this was created in 2014 and it's had 1816 downloads. Now compared to some of the other downloads they've had, this is believe it or not, I don't think this is very desirable. But let's just read some of these comments before we download it. I really hope this lives up to the hype. This miss crackra, but OMG, what I love about it is it's like a tree hoose. Is Maxis okay? What the fuck? Wow, I see your the ultimate bachelor pad is not cool. I shocked Pio Play most like your Maxis. Don't worry, <laughs> you're lucky. If this is Maxis's standards, I can work there. Ooh, ouch. Maxis, please. This is the absolute most glorious thing I've ever witnessed. The ultimate bachelor pad, no description given. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> didn't even bother. Maxis, which one of you was fucking around on this morning? Which one of you had to come into work, wasn't happy about it and thought, fuck it. This is what I'm gonna do today. Give me my paycheck. Yep, you'll be a bachelor forever with this build. <laughs> now someone says, I think they made this in one of the live streams or something. That makes it worse to me. Cause you're just exposing live that you can't build. FBI open up. Ooh, damn. This is why your game is a joke and we can't take you guys seriously. I think people were getting a bit too mad about this. Not even little Simsy could fix this. No, but she could probably complain about it. Love you, Kayla. I think we should just, we get the gist, right? Let's uh, let's download this and just see what the hell is going on. I really didn't mean it, Kayla. I'm not that mean. Love you. All right, let the fucking fun begin. Let's go to, um, what's it called? New Crest, New Crest. I am bad at this game, man. And let's, um, let's just stick it somewhere. See, look, look, see, see, see? There is love there. I'm just, I'm scared of her fans. They scare me. You're all so mad <laughs> all the time. Should we have it away from everything or should we have it like around the back of the newbie? So if I do make a playthrough, then we'll just see this monstrosity behind the house. I might do that. Let's stick it in here. All right. <laughs> <laughs> I can't wait to see what shit housery this is. If this was done in a live stream, by the way, do let me know. Let me know if you watched it. Let me know if, if it sort of made more sense when it was being built at the time. But, but I mean, it was like six years ago and I, I take it down, just remove it, delete it, burn it. Do you know what? This is gonna be a really shit video if it turns out to be actually, <laughs> what the fuck is that? Let's just go and build and buy for now. Just have a little look around. What the fuck is going on? Ha <laughs> 
I fucking love it. Okay, well, it hasn't quite worked out the way I wanted because it's obviously a bit rotated. So one more time. There we go. There we go. We've done it, guys. We've done it. It's in position. We are a go-go. Okay, so obviously going in, it's a little bit strange. Okay, so what they've tried to do, ironically, is they've tried to do a spiral staircase. Wow, it's almost like putting spiral staircases in the game is a good idea. It's almost like we've been requesting them since the game came out, huh? Now, if you guys at Maxis and EA want them so bad, how about you fucking put them in, huh? This is a very awkward build because you can't sort of zoom in with stuff and without it just freaking out a little bit. So let's just let's just head on up. Right, let's put the walls up. Oh, that is that is the walls up. That is the. Oh my god, it's just so bad, isn't it? So once you come up the stairs, there's a little barbecue out front, and there's. <laughs> so there's a little barbecue, a little bar area, just on the outside, just with no, no, no fencing, just, just, just walk off the edge. To be fair, if I lived there, I would probably consider that. that, that that's just... Yeah, sure. I am just utterly baffled by this build. Right, let's go inside. Let's get in here. Okay. Oh my god. So this is... This is it. This is, this is the pad. Stop. You have a, a chair facing, I don't know what that face is. Is there gonna be a TV on the wall or? It's just a chair facing a bin. The trash is on the inside, I promise. I mean, shower with glass walls so everyone can see. What is this? What is this? What is this? What is this build? This is very, very upsetting. And the fact that it comes from EA themselves. I think that comment about taking the game seriously is, is, um, it's kind of valid right now. If this is the quality that EA builds, it's no wonder that they're now starting to get like really, really talented simmers to do builds for their expansion packs because it's, it's just a mess. Is it going to let me sort of move around without it freaking out? Okay, it is. So they've been kind enough to give us a computer, um, and a little tiny kitchen area. And I'm guessing we have to use, we have to use the bathroom sink. <laughs> bathroom. We've just got like a little tiny prep area. And then eating will all be done outside on the little table. That's it. Okay, well, thank you all for watching. What the fuck is going on with this build? Oh, I've got a good idea. I've got a very good idea. They want 25,000 simoleons for that shit show. And there's really only one person that I can think of that will really, really suit this house. <laughs> His torture will never end. We're gonna put... Give me a moment. System breach. Oh. Firewall one. We got a problem. What? Someone synced a rat to one of my servers. A remote access tool. We're being hacked. What? They're on to us. We're gonna put the world's most unpopular bachelor in the ultimate bachelor pad. This is gonna work. This is gonna go great. <laughs> I think I've lost my fucking mind. I've lost my mind. Well, he's doing just fine and dandy. And he's not going anywhere near the house. I don't blame you, son. Ooh, Katrina Caliente. Well, you need to come up to my bachelor pad. God, it feels like, um, it feels like that series on Netflix called You, doesn't it? If anyone knows what I'm talking about. It's all just blurry now. It's blurry. It's all gone tits. This is the worst design of all time. <laughs> like, oh, ah! oh, yes. Oh, yes. Don't you just love my trash can? Doesn't my trash can just look so good, Katrina? Katrina, come and look at my trash can. I would look on the computer for something to do, but you have taken the only spot, so the only entertainment I get is looking at my trash can. So let's talk more about you. Do you like trash cans? I think I've lost my mind. This is ridiculous. How is this the ultimate bachelor pad? What part of this is ultimate? Seriously. Come and join us, Betty. To be fair, it is kind of working as a bachelor pad. Look at all of these ladies I'm getting up here. Everybody come to my place. No, come back with the fruitcake. Get in my house. No, don't leave. I don't leave. 
Oh, okay. One goes in, one goes out. Okay. Oh, nobody wants to stay in my pad. We could make like a Sims 4 version of that game facade with this, I'm sure. There's something there, aren't there? They're just, they're just out there eating their own fruitcake. They don't, they don't care. They don't care. They've had enough. I'm not even going to try and fix this. I think Kayla should probably try and fix it. Someone tell Kayla to fix it. I, I don't, I don't know. It's, it's not down to me. I mean, I wouldn't know where to start with something like this. I'm more likely to make something like this, to be honest. I'm not a good builder at all. It really does kind of work as a battle about, huh? So, how's your week been? Have you been up to much? I've been busy. You know? And she's left. <laughs> what is this food, though? Ooh, wow, look, cheese pizza. I didn't know you could get cheese pizza in The Sims. Well, like, you know, like from a stall. Carrot cake, cupcake, that sounds delicious. See, this is more interesting than the fucking bachelor pad. This has got more going on. The butternut squash soup is more interesting than the bachelor pad. Lobster roll, I do like a lobster roll. You know, forget the pad. We're gonna go and order a lobster roll and then I'm just leaving this hell hole where it deserves to be. Right by the newbie's house. <laughs> Look at it, be fucking ashamed of yourselves. My word. Hey, pretty lady, wanna come up to my bachelor pad? It's ultimate. She didn't want to, she's not interested. Megan, me, whoa, hello, hello, hello. Hey, I'm telling you, women just gravitate towards this dude. It's, it's like nothing I've ever seen in The Sims 4. <laughs> this is the content we're after. This is the content we wanted. This is what we're here for. Birdie Boots and her quest for a good lobster roll. You ever had a lobster roll? They're good, they're real nice. Real nice, get some, some br Get off my lobster roll, bitch, you can't have it. Go away, you're not part of this. What a fucking creep. Piss off. Take you and your stupid fucking hat away. Thank you, bye. Oh, for God's sake. As I was saying, the important part here, for a good lobster roll, Okay, you need some brioche bread, like a brioche roll. It's nice and sweet. The fuck is going on? You gotta get some fresh lobster. I mean, all lobster should be fresh. You know, you can't sort of let it die and then bacteria festers in it and stuff. Ooh, we've learned how to make it. Fantastic. Anyway, let's leave these women. Let's leave these women to it. So you need fresh lobster, not frozen, okay? Get some garlic butter in your brioche roll, okay? It will make all the difference. Mm. And then just like, while you're there, have a little squeeze of lemon juice and that's it that's all you need that's all you need for a good lobster roll don't don't faff around with it okay don't ruin it don't embellish it in silly ways okay keep it nice simple fresh vibrant i'm sorry i sort of just turned this episode into how to make a really good lobster roll um anyway i'm gonna say that kind of wraps up this episode to be honest i i, I guess i kind of thought it was going to be a little bit more eventful but i am very glad that we explored that monstrosity because I've never seen anything like it. Would you live there? I certainly wouldn't live there. Why would you think of this? Why would you come up with this? Why did you come up with this? We do not know her, okay? Delete her. If you want to find it yourself, just type in Maxis and then just go on household, scroll down. It'll, it'll stick out like a sore thumb, I promise. And let me know what you would do with it. Fix it up, do something with it. But um, for now, I think we've found the worst build the EA has ever made. I'm at a loss, ladies and gentlemen. I'm at an absolute loss. Apologies for the week off I had from filming. Uh, all last week, I was recording music like every single day um, for a new upcoming project that won't be revealed for a very long time and a project for the two year anniversary of my debut album Villains, which will be announced very, very soon. Um, brand new take on all of the songs from my album. Uh, it's been recorded during lockdown here at home um, and I can't wait for you guys to hear it. There'll be more on that very, very shortly. Um, if you want to see more regular updates, if you want more frequent news about what I'm up to and what I'm doing that isn't just the ultimate bachelor pad, then please go ahead and join my Patreon. You can join from just one pound a month, which is just 12 pounds a year, um, which is probably about the price of a really good lobster roll. I will be honest, if it, I shouldn't have worded it like that because a lobster roll does sound more appealing. Um, 
Mm. If you do decide to join my Patreon and do forgo your lobster roll, you will get blog posts that I don't post anywhere else. You'll get exclusive pictures, um, exclusive videos. I take video requests on there. You get early access to all of my YouTube videos. You also get access to song demos from the past, from the present. Um, I recently put up my first ever EP called Human Behavior for download, which I released back in 2012, I think, um, which isn't widely accessible. I'm about to create a new Patreon exclusive series where I reread my self-help book that I wrote back in 2017 called Feel Good 101. I'm going to read through it and see what I would change, what I still agree with. Um, it's going to just be chapter by chapter. Um, I'm hoping to start filming that in the next week or so. Um, so do go ahead and join my Patreon if you join just the basic £1 tier, then you'll have access to all of that. But until next time, guys, thank you so much for watching. Please give me some, uh, some, some, some video ideas for The Sims 4. Um, if you come across any hideous builds that you would like me to do a little deep dive on, then I'll happily do it. Let me know what other kind of content you want. It doesn't have to be gaming, but if, if you do like the gaming stuff, let me know what games you'd like me to play. I can always revisit stuff if you want, like Papers, Please, or, or whatever. We're just having fun here right now. I'm just doing whatever the hell I want. You know, it's a good vibe. But thank you guys so much for watching, and as always, I shall catch you later. I really want a lobster roll. <sighs> You can always get what you want But if you try sometimes You'll find you get what you need ah!